How to use anti-static wrist strap laptop. There are numerous methods to accomplish this, but the correct method is the most perplexing. You want to know how to use it now that you've read and heard about it. So, how do you use a laptop with an anti-static wrist strap? Before you can be sure you're doing anything correctly, you must first understand what they are and what they do. It's right now. Attain it. How to use an anti-static wrist strap properly. A strap may be worn on any part of your body, although most people choose to wear it on their wrist. On the strap, there will be a bit of metal that will come into contact with your flesh. You'll need to adjust the strap if the metal isn't hitting your flesh. After you've finished that, follow these steps to get started. Turn off the power to your computer. On the back of your computer, there will be a switch that will allow you to turn it off. Connect the power cable from the power source to an electrical socket in your home. To secure the wrist strap, use an alligator clip. Attach the clip on the power supply patch's metal grill or even the PSU fan. To keep it firmly in place, you'll need a clip, so make sure it's fastened to the metal. Because you'll be moving the components within the tower with your hand, the clip can't be closed. Do not clamp the clip to the painted metal. Because paint metal may lack insulation, it will be unable to properly ground you. Always go for bare metal, since it's the best option. What is an anti-static wrist strap, and how does it work? In video tutorials and even at your local computer store and repair facility, you may have heard or seen technicians use anti-static wristbands when building computers. This should be enough to convince you that you require them while constructing a computer. The voltage differential between your body and the computer is balanced using an anti-static wristband. The excess static charge in your body will be eliminated quickly by wearing an anti-static wristband. For anti-static wrist straps, a grounding pin method. This is a fantastic technique to get grounded on your tower, and it works well. There are, however, alternative options. There are additional grounding pins available, which allow you to land on the pins while wearing anti-static clip wraps. As with the last method, place your bandage on your wrist with the metal contacting your flesh. Warning, this approach might be quite dangerous, therefore I recommend that you just examine the placement of your grounding pin, as each nation has its own. You will be electrocuted if you do not follow this procedure correctly. The alligator clip may be connected to a grounding pin on your outlet, but make sure the electricity is turned off before attaching it to the pin or hook. Start, for power supply, use an anti-static wrist strap that is grounded. Step 1. Wear a strap with a metal component that comes into contact with your skin. Note, it may be worn on any part of your body. It's not only in your hands. Step 2. Plug the power cable into the outlet after turning off the power source. Step 3. You may attach the alligator clip to the power supply screw or the PSU fan grills. Note, any metal should be done as long as it is bare metal and the paint is not metal, as some paints include insulation and some do not. Step 4. Make sure it's firmly trimmed. Once everything is in order, you should guarantee that you are grounded and that any charges against you are promptly dismissed. Step 5. Wear an anti-static wristband with metal that comes into contact with your skin. Step 6. Before you connect the alligator clip, locate your grounding pin. Important, the location of the grounding pin will vary depending on your location. If you play sports with the wrong equipment, you're more likely to get electrocuted. Step 7. Depending on where your grounding pin is placed, connect the alligator clip to the store's grounding pin. Note, before moving on to the alligator clip, make sure the switch is positioned on the pin slash ping. Step 8. Work with your installation and be careful about ESD damage to your computer's key components. What is the best way to use anti-static on my computer? What is the best way to use anti-static on my computer? Here are some helpful hints. 1. To keep your PSU grounded, keep it connected, but turn off the unit. 
2. It it best to avoid touching one's face on carpeted floors. 3. Before handling components, touch a metal portion of the chassis. 4. Working on a sturdy, hard surface is recommended. 5. Make use of an ESD mat. When should a ground wrist strap not be worn? When should a ground wrist strap not be worn? It doesn't happen every time you use your computer that you need to attach yourself to the ground with an anti-static wrist strap. When an anti-static wrist strap is deemed superfluous in the following situations. Asterisk it might be beneficial if you switched your network adapter. Asterisk connect and disconnect your keyboard and mouse from the computer's back. Asterisk because a CRT, cathode ray tube, monitor has a very high voltage, it should not be used. Asterisk furthermore, only qualified experts are permitted to do so. FAQs, how to use anti-static wrist strap laptop. If I don't have an anti-static wrist strap, what can I do? If you're worried about static and don't have an anti-static wristband, just conduct your installs with your arm or hand contacting the case metal or right before picking up a part to install. Do you need an anti-static wrist strap when building a PC? There's no need for an anti-static mat or a wrist strap. It's preferable to connect it to the computer and then disconnect the electrical connector from the motherboard. If you're operating with one hand, be sure your arm isn't contacting a metal component of the case. How do you ground yourself when working on a laptop? Place your hand momentarily on a metal item to eliminate any static before touching anything inside the laptop. Hold any peripheral cards by the edges while handling them. Circuits can be harmed by oil on the skin. An anti-static wrist bracelet can give you a base when you work out. Where do you attach the anti-static wrist strap? The wrist strap may be attached to the ground in a variety of locations. Wrist straps can be attached to an open field or linked to electrical outlets through wires worn within a knitted cuff ESD clothing, such as a metal table on a stone floor. How do you use an anti-static wrist strap? Wear a strap that comes into touch with your skin and has a metal component. It may be worn anywhere on the body. It is not solely under your control. After shutting off the power source, plug the power cord into the outlet. The alligator clip may be attached to the power supply screw or the PSU fan grills. How long does it take you to re-establish your grounding? Allow all of your body's weight and tension to be absorbed into the ground by sinking it into your feet, without collapsing your posture. Imagine roots emerging out the bottoms of your feet, stretching deep into the ground under you, to aid this anchoring process. Time range, 1 to 10 minutes. Conclusion How to use anti-static wrist strap laptop So that concludes the how to use anti-static wrist strap laptop instruction. There are times when people claim that they don't require it. However, because this is your computer through which you are developing your computer, it is preferable to wear it and be absolutely certain that you will not regret destroying it with your freshly acquired computer component. Aren't putting themselves in jeopardy instead.